Ocean Air is the leading manufacturer of water-cooled portable air conditioners. The most popular unit is the OWC 1811 QC, which operates on 110 volt, 15 amp power. No need to duct hot air outside or into a nearby space. 100% of the heat is transferred via the water. Before placing the unit, locate the water source to ensure you have enough hose to reach the unit. After you decide where the unit will be positioned, make sure that the casters are faced in and locked. This is not only a safety feature, but locking the casters will prevent the unit from rolling when installing the water connections. The quick connect fittings are spring loaded and easy to install. Simply push the water connection onto the fixture of the unit. When pushing the fittings on, listen for a click then give it a little tug to ensure that it is securely fastened. When installing the water connection, the unit is labeled water in, water out, and drain. The hoses are also labeled and color coded to ensure proper hose connection. The drain hose is a different size to protect against improper connection. There may be times when the hose is not long enough to reach the desired location. In this case, you will want to use the hose kit adapter, which has a garden hose connection on one end and quick connect fittings on the other end. Attach the quick connect fittings as was attached on the unit. Heavy duty garden hose is required. The condensate hose has a 3 8 inch barbed fitting. Attach a 3 8 inch clear hose and secure with a pipe clamp. Installing the hoses improperly could cause damage to the unit. After the hoses are connected to the unit, walk the hoses to the water supply. The hose kit comes standard with a fitting that connects to the standard slop sink faucet. Slop sink is ideal for several reasons. The spigot is the same size as a standard garden hose fitting and the water pressure is stronger than a standard kitchen or bathroom sink. Adapters are needed when the faucet is not the same size as a standard hose fitting. After connecting the water in hose to the faucet, zip tie the three hoses to prevent water slipping out of the sink. After the hoses are all connected and secured, turn on the cold water. It will take a few minutes for the cold water to cycle through the air conditioner and discharge warm water. There will be instances where you will want to install more than one water-cooled unit, both receiving water from the same faucet. When this is required, you can use a splitter or manifold to supply multiple units from a single. Only after all the hoses are connected, power up the unit. If an extension cord must be used, it must be minimum 12 gauge. On the top left of the unit is a deluxe electronic controller where the power switch is located. The controller displays the operating mode, cool, and is used to set the fan operation to automatic or manual. When in manual, the fan speed can be adjusted for low, medium, or high output volume. The temperature select buttons displays the intake temperature, ambient, and the discharge temperature, cooled air from the air conditioner, as well as the desired temperature, the set point, with lowest temperature of 55 degrees Fahrenheit. The controller also displays a small red light when the compressor is calling for cool air. When the air conditioner is operating properly, warm water will be discharged from the water tube into the slop sink. It will be approximately 105 degrees. The drain tube will only discharge water when the condensate tank is full and water needs to be pumped out. The deluxe electronic controller on a water-cooled unit will display the flashing letters CON when there is an alarm condition. CON indicates a fault condition is present that must be addressed. For example, the water supply has been reduced or inadvertently turned off, or the condensate pump might be restricted. Either of these conditions will trip the high pressure sensitivity switch, which will need to be reset. Once the originating issue has been resolved and the unit reset, CON will be cleared and the air conditioner will return to proper operation. When the job is done, power the air conditioner down, Turn off the water and disconnect the hoses from the water source. Don't forget to collect any adapters that may have been used. 
Once outside, snap the lanyards into the hoses to break the vacuum and allow residual water to drain from the hoses. Ocean Air products are proudly made in the USA. Ocean Air offers 24-7 tech support. Visit our website's tech support section for more information. For general inquiries, visit oceanair-inc.com or call 847-583-0311. Ocean Air, providing a better climate anywhere.